Hey, curious minds. Welcome to Discoverix, where we uncover the hidden wonders of the world around us. Today, we're diving into the science behind simple objects we use every day. Get ready to be amazed by the secrets that make these everyday items so fascinating. Have you ever wondered how a pencil writes or why a balloon floats? Well, behind these ordinary things are incredible scientific principles. Let's explore them together. The wonder of a simple pencil graphite, a form of carbon, is the secret behind the marks of pencil leaves on paper. It's soft enough to transfer onto the paper, but strong enough to hold its shape. Friction between the graphite and the paper is what allows the pencil to write. Without it, the graphite would just slide off. Did you know pencils come in different grades of hardness? This depends on the amount of clay mixed with the graphite. More clay means a harder, lighter mark. The mystery of a sticky note, the adhesive on sticky notes, is made of polyacrylate, a material that's sticky enough to hold the paper but not so sticky that it damages it. The surface of the sticky note is designed to be smooth, allowing the adhesive to stick and release without leaving residue. On rough surfaces, it doesn't work as well. The invention of the sticky note was almost an accident. A weak adhesive that didn't tea stick well enough ended up becoming one of the most useful tools in the world. The fascinating physics of a balloon. Balloons float because the hot air inside them is less dense than the surrounding air. This creates buoyancy, making the balloon rise. The elasticity of latex allows the balloon to expand as air is blown into it. But be careful blow too much and it pops. Does the color of the balloon affect its buoyancy? Yes. Darker colors absorb more heat, which can make the balloon rise faster. The power of a simple magnet. Magnets create magnetic fields that attract or repel objects with magnetic properties, like iron. Every magnet has two poles, north and south. Like poles repel, while opposite poles attract. Magnets are everywhere. They're used in refrigerators, speakers, and even the hard drives in your computer. The science of a clean cup of tea. Water needs to reach a specific temperature to release the chemical compounds in tea leaves, creating the perfect flavor. The shape of the teapot affects the oxygenation of the water, which can alter the tea's taste. Tea leaves contain tannins, which give the bitter taste, and antioxidants, which are great for your health. The secret of toasters. Toasters use electrical resistors to generate heat. The timer mechanism cuts off the heat at the right moment to prevent burning. The timer inside a toaster works with a spring system activated by heat. When the spring cools, it pops the toast up. Some modern toasters have moisture sensors that adjust the toasting. Time based on how dry or moist the bread is. The magic of ballpoint pens. The ink in ballpoint pens is viscous and only flows when the ball at the tip rotates. This prevents leaks and ensures smooth writing. The ball at the tip is made of durable materials like tungsten carbide and is responsible for evenly distributing the ink. Ballpoint ink dries quickly because it's oil-based, which prevents smudging and makes writing hassle-free. The engineering of zippers. Zippers work with interlocking teeth. The slider aligns the teeth to close and separates them to open. The teeth are made of metal or plastic and are designed to fit together perfectly, creating a tight seal. The zipper was invented in the 19th century, but only became popular during World War I when it was used in military uniforms. The chemistry of soap. Soap molecules have two ends, one that attracts water and one that attracts grease. This allows soap to remove dirt. When you rub your hands with soap, it forms tiny structures called micelles which trap grease and dirt, allowing them to be washed away. Soap also breaks down the fatty layer surrounding some viruses and bacteria, making them harmless. That's why hand washing is so effective. The technology of LED light bulbs. LEDs emit light when an electric current passes through a semiconductor material like silicon. 
This process is called electroluminescence. Lead bulbs are much more efficient than incandescent ones because they convert almost all their energy into light instead of heat. An LED can last up to 50,000 hours, meaning it can work for over 10 years, even with daily use. So, curious minds, now you know that even the simplest objects hide incredible science. From pencils to lead bulbs, everything we use has a fascinating story behind it. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more scientific curiosities. Leave here in the comments what you are curious about and would like to see here on our channel. Until next time, remember, the world is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. See you soon. Thank you for watching.